So this is a short little video to demonstrate the Honda NTV 600 Revere mainly to show that me as the person who's selling it has had experience of riding it and can actually describe what it's like. So anyway, first I'm going to just climb on and start the engine. One of the first things you notice with this bike is how low the seat height is. It feels a fair bit lower than most similar sorts of bikes. But anyway, moving on, ignition on. You can see you've got the neutral light on there, all pressure light on there. And also you've got a side stand light. If I move that up and down, you can see that there. So that's good. Seems to start every time, so um, though I can't guarantee the battery, it seems like it's okay. Anyway, the first thing I'm going to do is up to the junction and apply the rear brake. I have a feel of that, make sure that's as it should be. And so just playing a little bit of the rear brake now, a little bit more. I can feel from that the rear disc feels nice and flat, and the rear brake feels as powerful as it should do. Now the same for the front, a little bit of front brake, a bit more. I can feel from that too, the front brake feels this feels flat and the brake feels as powerful as it should do. Uh, now I'm going to quietly work my way through the gears, having listened to the transmission. And this first, second, third, fourth, and into fifth. And I can hear from that, the transmission all sounds nice and quiet, there's nothing there to be concerned about. And in a moment I'm going to pull back the accelerator, the throttle in, the top gear, from low rev, making sure there's no electrical breakdown in the high tension circuits, so uh, bring that back now. And the bike immediately accelerates around both cylinders without any difficulty at all. And the horn. One last thing I'm going to do is take my hands off the handlebars, show they're going nice and straight, which it does. I can't find anything wrong with the bike, it just feels just as it should do. So that's the test done.